nobody told me that that's why i was so naive i was just you know it paid me it paid me die <laughs> Hey people, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, according to your time. My name is Ezin Le, if you're meeting me for the first time, and this is Z Sport. How are you all doing? Hope everybody is doing great. To my old subscribers, thank you so much for always watching my videos. And to my new subscribers, you are highly welcome to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you guys or tell you guys what you should know before going for IUI procedure. Disclaimer, I'm not a doctor, mm -mm. I'm not a nurse, mm -mm. yeah, um, I'm just here to, you know, to share my experience because I've experienced that and uh, no one told me what I should know before going for the procedure, so, and I, I thought it's, it's a wise something to come out here and share with you guys what. I know you know what I have experienced anyway so without speaking so much grammar <laughs> let's start this video so number one thing you should know I wrote everything down here so I won't forget anything my book so let's start um, what is IUI intra uterine insemination procedure means when sperm is placed directly into the uterus using a small catheter i will insert um a definition here or here so you guys will also see it and know the meaning of iui procedure so um let us just start this video number one thing you should know it is not 100 percent sure that you will get pregnant after the procedure hell no capital no 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 it is not 100 percent sure even doctor will tell you that they are not guaranteeing you that it will work mm -mm. meaning that it is not a hundred percent sure something yeah some might do it the first time and they got they will get pregnant some the second time they will test positive some third time they will put they will test positive fourth time they will test positive some will not will not even test positive so that means it is not 100 percent sure that you will get pregnant after the iui procedure even ivf ivf self is not even 100 percent sure ivf that they will bring the sperm they will fertilize the sperm and the egg and insert the embryo still after the orishi orishi it's not even 100 percent sure that it will work so just know that just have it in your in the back of your mind that it is not 100 percent sure that you will get pregnant after the iui procedure please nobody told me that that's why i was so naive i was just you know it paid me it paid me die <laughs> when my own failed <laughs> but if i knew that oh it's a 50 50 something then i will just i'll prepare my mind i'll prepare myself and yeah so just know that it is not sure 100 percent sure that you will get pregnant after the procedure so the second one is it painful mm, i can't say for everybody i'm just saying from my own side it wasn't painful i just felt a sharp slight pain when they when they um and start um the 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 catheter yeah inside my pickles <laughs> i felt a sharp slight pain just a side just a slight sharp pain it wasn't that painful like you know like pain 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 no 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 i don't know about any other person i'm talking about my own experience it wasn't painful yeah my sister although how painful oh it's not painful yeah so i don't know about men because um they have to provide a spam in the hospital not even at home you have to you cannot come from from your house and you know bring your spam from the house so you have to stay in the hospital and provide the spam yeah so i don't know about their own side i'm talking about my own side it wasn't painful i just felt a slight sharp 
pain just like few seconds procedure they are done like few seconds bam 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 it's like um doing pap tests like that kind of sh pain that kind of sh slight pain I'm, yeah if anything if you have done pap tests before you know what i'm trying to say and it doesn't take time just few seconds they are done so the next one how would they know that you have relating or you know me during my own time they told me to go and i should buy um, ovulation kits um i should start from the first like from the first day i saw my period i should count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten on the tenth day i should start testing myself morning and night morning and night so that's that's like okay i tested it then the, and they told me that the day my test showed two solid lines i should just give them a call immediately so i told them that i don't want to test myself i might make mistake you know and they said that they they, they they can't do anything i think it's because of COVID. i told them to test me then they said i should you know take my blood or anything i was you know each one way and they now told me that they can't do anything i think because of covid they are trying to avoid anything and like body contacts yeah so because of covid they said i should just go home and do it myself and they cannot do it now because of covid blah 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 so i went home i did it myself so you have to test from morning to night the day you the day your test showed two solid lines yeah you can give you give not even you can you give them a call and uh, they will book you the next morning like my own showed in the night yeah then i called them immediately they booked me the next day 10 a.m in the morning so yeah so that's how they will know that I, yeah they want to tell them i don't know about now i'm talking about 2020 to uh, yeah yeah 2020 so the next one is um how long does it take for you to check uh uh, whether you are pregnant and um, we have to wait for two weeks yes you have to wait like when my daughter told me that i have to wait for two weeks before i could even you know check whether i'm pregnant i was pregnant then but for me then i was having pregnancy symptoms like these hormones there eh, really dealt with me i was like having high sense of high sense of smell morning sickness tiredness you know those kind uh, pregnancy symptoms so then i was even 100 percent sure that hey oh my oh my god you know i was pregnant i was sure that you know i was pregnant then but yeah you have to wait for two weeks before you can check whether you are pregnant and i wish you so luck i wish you so luck i wish you luck 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 i wish you luck positive results so yeah i think that is it for this um what you should know before going for iui procedure just have it at the back of your mind that it's not guaranteed that you will get pregnant after the uh, iui procedure yeah nobody told me that if i knew i would have prepared myself like i said before so just know that it is not guaranteed that you will get pregnant even ivf safe is not even guaranteed talk more of iui so yeah that is it like i said disclaimer i'm not a doctor i'm just here to um educate some people that don't know about this because so, like i i was discussing with my friend two days ago i was telling her about the iui procedure it was like she was like this is her first time hearing of that that she didn't know that they have uh, that kind of thing I was like, eh? Let me try hold on one hour. I watch hold on one hour. So she said that she uh, that that's her first time hearing it. So that's why I said, oh, I should make a video. People, people, people didn't even really know about that. After my friend told me that that's her first time hearing it, I was like, oh, people, maybe people don't know about IUI. Yes, we have IUI sperm insemination. Yeah, we do have that. So I'm here to um to uh, uh, tell you guys or educate you guys what iui is all about and what you should know before going for iui um yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video please share this video to people people 
people out there might need it or you need this kind of videos please share and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet like this video um comment and uh, i will see you in my next for now bye